Hi, I'm Simon with AppliancePartsPros.com. Today we're going to show you how to repair your appliance. Are you ready? Remember, anytime you work on your appliance, make sure it's unplugged or the circuit breakers are off so there's no chance of electrocution. In this video, we'll show you how to replace the door switch in a GE dishwasher. It's going to be a very easy repair. It should only take a few minutes to show you how to do it. For this job, we're going to need a Phillips and a flat blade screwdrivers. When you open up the package, you're going to get a new door switch. The door switch is installed in the upper portion of the dishwasher's door. It latches the door and communicates its status to the control board. The main reason why it would need to be replaced is if it breaks, causing the door not to latch or the dishwasher not to start. To get to the part, we need to open the door. So we are going to remove uh, three screws on each side and uh, take off the control panel. I'm using a Phillips screwdriver. Hold on to the control panel. When you're taking out the last screw, let's close the door partially and then we're going to pull up. and out. Be careful with not breaking this uh, mounting pin when you pull out the control panel and put it back in. You need to go on the side from this uh, plastic casing. And then we're going to take out these two Phillips screws on the top that holds the uh, door switch. Alright, so I'm going to pull it out and uh, now we need to remove this cover. I'm going to use the uh, flat blade screwdriver. We're going to open these tabs here. And uh, pop these tabs. And the cover should come off. And now we see the switches and the wires. So we need to remove the wires. So we have two blacks on the common and uh, two blacks with uh, white stripes on the uh, normally open. So let's take the uh, second switch out. And we're going to remove the wires from the switch. And yeah, that's uh, two white ones on the outside and uh, white and red on the inside here. This is the old door switch next to the new one. If you don't have this part, you can get it from appliancepartspros.com. All right, this is a new door switch. We need to open this cover to attach the wires to the switches. Uh, flat blade screwdriver, I'm going to use that to pop open a few tabs. All right, the cover is off. We got the two switches. Now we're going to connect the wires. All right, so to make it easier, I'm going to hold down this plunger, remove one switch, put this box on the table, and then I'm going to connect the wires. So the longer one goes on this common, and the second one goes on this one. Then I'm going to take the, the switch box and place that uh, micro switch on the two posts and again hold down to the plunger and remove the second micro switch and again the longer one goes on this side and the shorter one on this side and I'm going to place it here And now we can put on the cover. Mm -hmm. 
and uh, open the door, place the switch, match the holes, and we're going to secure it with a couple of flat top Phillips screws. It works. So now we're going to install the control panel. Right, we're going to slide that uh, plastic cover in first, and then we put the right side in. While we're lowering down the control panel with one hand, push the outer door in with the uh, second hand. So to make sure that it fits into the groove uh, at the bottom of the control panel. Then we can uh, secure the control panel with the screws. We're going to install the first uh, couple of screws on this side and then tighten it using a Phillips screwdriver. And we'll go on the opposite side and also place a uh, couple screws. Now I'm going to place the uh, last two screws and tighten them. And now we can close the door. Plug the dishwasher in and enjoy your clean dishes. Thank you for being a part of another successful repair brought to you by AppliancePartsPros.com. For any of your future appliance repair projects, please check out our other videos available on our site, on Facebook, on YouTube, and on Instagram.